Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Christina and welcome if you are new here. So in today's video, I'm going to be doing the June Fairy Loot unboxing. I just got my box in today, so I'm going to say it's for June. I think it is, yeah, um, since it's the 1st of July. So I wanted to open this up with you guys. Um, I'm not going to lie, I already opened it up and I already know what's inside, so I'm really excited to share with you guys. I could not resist and I could not wait, so... If you're excited to see what July's, no, what June's box has in store, then let's get started. All right, so here's what the box looks like in the inside. And this is the spoiler card that's very bent up. And this theme was Chosen Ones. So yeah, this is a spoiler card. We'll look at this after I'm done showing everything. So the first thing I'm pulling out is a book sleeve. I was literally just talking about book sleeves yesterday on my live. Um, so I'm excited to get one. This is like a pleather material and it's inspired by the Atlas 6, Atlas 6, which I think I'm going to pick up, but I need to find the um, paperback edition for it because I think I would rather have the paperback than the hardcover. But anyway, so in the inside, it's just this black soft material um this is very very good quality and this was designed by chatty nora the next item i'm pulling out is a trinket dish this is from rin um this is designed by ours 28 and this is what it looks like it's really pretty i like these little trinket trays although i'm running out of space where to display them and i think this was inspired by the poppy war if i'm not mistaken yeah it's um inspired by the poppy war by rf huang the next item i'm pulling out is string or sting paper tabs designed by jizz hawk and this is what they are. Oops, they're little swords. And I guess these are for like when you want to annotate or whatever. They're little tabs. So that's cute. That's cute. I suck at annotating, so I probably will not really use these, but I'll definitely pass them along to somebody who will. And the book tabs or the paper tabs are inspired by Lord of the Rings by J.R.R. Tolkien. Okay, so the next thing we're pulling out is going to be the paperback edition book that we are getting in this box. And this is what she looks like. This is um, One Throne, Twin Crowns, Two Princesses by Catherine Weber. Um, I guess Catherine Doyle and Catherine Weber. So this is what it looks like it's really pretty i'm low-key obsessed with the way this looks and not only is the cover pretty but it has sprayed and stenciled edges that is stunning and then we do have like the end pages have some kind of design on it as well i'm so scared to crack the spine on this because this is really pretty and then also it's signed by both authors i don't know anything about this book but i'm really interested to find out what it's about because of the cover it's really gorgeous or at least this edition is really gorgeous so i'm excited to figure out what this one is going to be about and hopefully i'll pick it up soon the next thing i'm pulling out is this art card um i don't know who this is inspired by but she's giving me warrior vibes for sure. Very gorgeous. Love that. So it's an Adlina art print and it was designed by Damien in the Den. It is inspired by the Young Elites by Murray Lou. I have not read that book yet. I don't know if I will, but this character is stunning. So the last two items that we have that I have to show you before I show you the um, hardcover edition for this month are the tarot cards. So this one is the lovers and this one is the chariot. So I'm getting um, what is the book? Oh my gosh. Uh, this is what they look like. I can't think of who from Blood and Ash. That's who they're reminding me of. Poppy and Hawk. 
And then I don't know who this character is. But they're both pretty. The art it is really gorgeous. Um, okay, so the tarot cards were illustrated by, by Rs28. And they feature Hawk and Poppy. And then Karen from Blood and Ash by Jennifer L. Armentrout. So I was correct on that one. And then the last item is the book of the month. We have the monthly bookmark that is the same as the spoiler card we have spare the fairy scoop which i'll look at here in a minute and then we have the author letter which is another gorgeous art print and then this month's book is the vicious grace by emily feed it says her gift can save or it can kill And then we have the author signature and then we have the synopsis right here for you guys. Hopefully you guys were able to screenshot so that way you can read what this book is about. I don't know anything about this book. It looks very fairy tale esque maybe. That's what I'm guessing it's going to be about, but we'll find out once we read the synopsis and figure out if this is something we want to read for July. Who knows? But yeah, that's it. That was in the this month's box. Um, and I pretty much told you guys already what the items were and the fandom and the creators. Uh, if I had to pick my favorite item from the box, I would definitely have to say the paperback that we got this this was my favorite because it's stunning it's pretty and I want to figure out a way to display it because how this is like the prettiest book probably that I own and the least favorite is probably the um, paper tabs because I really don't annotate so it's probably not gonna get any use at all so I'll probably just pass these along to somebody else that will for sure use them um, but yeah, that's it for this video. It was very chill, very mellow. Um, so hopefully you guys enjoyed it and I'll see you guys on the next one.